Hi farming friends, my name is Danny and today I'm going to be talking about the Blue Eddy EV70. Now there's two reasons why I bought the Blue Eddy EV70. First being is, here in Isabella we have a lot of brownouts mate. Daily. Sometimes they last for 10 minutes, sometimes they last for an hour. And sometimes we have brownouts that last for 12 hours. And the second reason is, our piggery is a long way from our house and there's no electricity there. And sometimes the pigs give birth at night time and we use the torches to see how the pigs are going when they're giving birth. And sometimes that can be very hard. So now I'll tell you some of the features about the Blue Eddy. Now this is the Blue Eddy EB70. I bought this from the Blue Eddy official store in Las Pinas and it was delivered by Ninja Van here yesterday. We unboxed it. And when we unboxed it and we turned it on, it was 80% fully charged. So last night I charged it again to get to 100%. Yesterday when we were unboxing this uh, power station, inside the box itself was this smaller box full of accessories, different ways to charge up the battery inside here. And I'll talk about this as we go along. Now I'll start showing you all the features of this Blue Eddy EB70. This is the LED light area here. To turn that on, you either press this button here or press this other button over here. This blue you can see here is a battery. Tells you how much uh, battery is left. At the moment, it's 100%. But as the battery is less and less, these blue bars go down. Now on the side here, you have how many watts are going out when you're charging something or you're using something. And up here is how many watts are going into this battery when it's charging. Now this port here is for charging the battery itself. Now there are two ways you can charge this battery. They give you this box which you can charge with electricity. Just plug it into one of your power points and charge the battery that way. Or you can charge, you charge your battery with these um, solar powered uh, connectors. So if you have like solar power on your roof, you just plug that into your solar power on your roof, plug it in there and that'll charge up the battery. Now I'll talk about different outlets on this uh, Blue Eddy. Over this side here, you have outlets for DC. What that means is, these two here are USB uh, for charging or running something. For instance, you can charge your mobile phone on one of these USBs, or you run your laptop with one of these USBs, now I'm not uh, electronic savvy at all. I know hardly anything about wattage or electricity or things like this inside. I don't know what these two things are here for. Perhaps you know and you can tell me. But this one here is for your uh, cigarette lighter in your car. If you're going away for a weekend, camping or just going somewhere for the day and the battery gets a bit low, you use this. You plug in your cigarette lighter in your kochi or your car, plug it in here, and that'll charge up the battery. Not a problem at all. Over this side here, we have the 220-240 outlet. So you just plug something like this in like that to uh, run a light, a fan, or even a TV. It's not a problem. This power station is a thousand watt power station. That means you can charge charge anything or run anything 
up to a thousand watts. And then you go over and the whole thing just shuts down. Okay, now we'll run a few things to the uh, power station to show you how to show you how it works. First of all we'll plug in the um, the mobile phone and charge that up using the USB port here. Now as you can see down the bottom here, the wattage it's using to charge that mobile phone is only about 2 watts, which is very low. Next we'll uh, plug in a light. This will go up this side here with the 220, 220 240. As you can see now, the, um, the wattage going out is 7, which is very, very low. Next we'll plug in this fan. Just start it up. Okay, give it a second. Okay, as you can see now, 18, 18. the wattage is around about 18 watts, which is very, very low. So by rights, Things like this can be uh, charged up and run for a long period of time before the battery will actually go flat, which is very good. Also, here on the front here, this is a light. It has uh, three different uh, modes. It has a low light. The light gets a bit stronger. And the third one... Right here they are. It's like an SOS, which is very good for night time. The last thing I'll show you is the top of the uh, power station. It has a nice handle to hold on to, nice and sturdy. Another feature here also, you can see here, this is for uh, wireless phone charging. So if you have a mobile phone and it can be charged wireless, you put your phone like that and it should charge by rights. But our phones, it doesn't work because our phones are not uh, the real McCoy, the Filipino made, that, so it doesn't work. You have to have something like a Samsung or something like that for it to start working. As I said in the beginning, I bought this Blue Eddy through Blue Eddy official website. They have a big office in Las, Las Pinas uh, the original price of this EB70 was 39000 Then they had a sale on. Then it went down to 30000 But when I bought this, they had another sale. And it went down to 27000 So if you're interested in buying something like this, just go online, look up their website. They have a lot of other different types of power stations with all different types of wattages and different prices. We're hoping that this will work out very well with not only our house but the piggery and we'll have no problems in the future with uh, electricity. So anyway guys, thanks for watching my video today. I hope you're having a great day wherever you are and I'll catch you again next time.